So in addition to all this stuff about diet and nutrition and, and even fasting, what's kind of your, just your quick bullet points, practical advice for the listener for other things they can do to improve their health. Oh yeah. And this is, this is basically the last question. Yeah. yeah. There's so. so much more to health. I think maybe 80% of it is what you eat. It's, it's crazy, but people will tell you all different things, but I've seen, I've seen it happen tons of times where people don't exercise more and they don't, you know, do all these things and all they do is change their diet and they have drastic results. So I really do think mm -hmm. what you eat and you know, when to not eat is 80% of it. Uh, but other than that, man, humans are meant to move something. I, I didn't work out last night and I went on a long walk. I'll go on an hour walk. You know, if I'm not working out, hour walk. Or if you want to work out, throw some weights around. You know, push your muscles to say, get stronger. You know, I, I actually don't spend long in the gym. I spend 25 minutes twice a week. That's it. 50 minutes wow. total. 50 minutes total. And you guys can look up pictures. You know, I'm not a, a slim... Uh, string being like weakling, you know, so it, you don't need a lot of time to get a lot of results. If you're, if you if you go hard sprint, I like to sprint, right? I, I love sprint. I, I, I don't think uh, jogging is very effective. I think you can go on sprint and get everything done in half the time. Uh, sleep. Well, absolutely. I focus on sleep every night. I'm getting eight hours of sleep. I don't, uh, yeah, I don't think people focus on this enough. There are all kinds of gadgets and different levels you can get to you, you know, to, to optimize it. But I think people don't even do the simple thing, which is if their alarm set for 6am, just get in bed at 10pm. That's the biggest thing is allow yourself enough sleep. So many people just don't even do that part. And then yes, you can get blue blocking glasses, you can get the things on your phone and your computer to make the red, you know, all this type of stuff. But man, get yourself in bed for eight hours. And then what else? I mean, yeah, they're, they're, from there, I think I think those are the biggest three. If the food is 80%, get that movement going and get your sleep dialed in, you, you're on your way. I mean, the rest is just gravy. And, you know, you could talk for hours about all the other things you can do. But those are the big three. Yeah. Yeah. I like those answers. And it just made me think also that, you know, a lot of people struggle with anxiety and mental health issues. And so that would be kind of another category, but that's partially addressed by some of these other health improvements. Mm -hmm. And so we don't have to get into all the details, obviously, but that's partially addressed by better nutrition and by exercise. And then there's some things like, you know, mindfulness mm -hmm. practices and, you know, getting off your devices in order to be able to sleep mm -hmm. like you talked about. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> so that's kind of just, just kind of maybe filling in the gap there a little bit, but something to talk more about on, on another occasion.